Exactly, exactly. Mm. And then I think I have some nice pictures here. Yeah, so these, these are some nice embryos. So this is after they've formed up. So you can see this is a immunostained. That's those antibody labelings. And you can see each one of these is a nucleus, a little fuzzy nucleus. So that's, mm. that's the epiblast cells and the, the primitive endoderm. And then down here, we actually have the whole embryo label. So you have the blue is the trophoblast. Those are your placental cells. And then your other two cell types there. Inside so that yeah, these little these little heads, these little snowman looking heads. Mm. Basically, there's a little uh proteoglycan capsid or capsule here called the, uh, the zona pellucida. That's basically an eggshell. Mm. All embryos all we we all live inside of a an eggshell and then we have to hatch out. And so there's a little bit that gets weak. And then it starts to pop out and then the embryo has to push through. And what you're seeing here is the embryo starting to push through that capsule. Is that sort of the divide? Yeah. Yeah, exactly. So this is, this is literally like, there's a little hole there that the embryo is literally squeezing through. And then, yeah. yeah. So wow. I, I was like, like, like grandpa, I like to say at the end of talk or at the beginning of talks when I'm explaining this, uh, and just like chickens, <laughs> we all have to hatch outside of our eggs to, to before we implant. Wow, that's so interesting. <laughs> Very rarely do people laugh at that, but I say it anyway, because it makes me... Yeah. 